They're walking out now, the A finalists of the women's sweater butterfly. We got one of the stars of the NCSA Junior Nationals in lane number four is the top seed, Cassidy Bayer. She'll definitely be uh, the one to watch here. Let's set up the lanes for you. In lane number one is Dorothy Homley, Homley, Homey from the Woodland Swim Team. In lane two is Ruby Martin from Iowa Flyers. Three, Marissa Delgado from Cincinnati Marlins. Lane four, Cassidy Bayer from Nation's Capital Swim Club. Five, Lauren Case from Chattahoochee. Lane six, Sydney Lofquist from Mason Mana Rays. Lane number seven, Kylie Jordan from Nation's Capital Swim Club. And in lane eight, Carly Glow from Highlander Aquatic Club. So Cassidy Bear, lane number four. She was far and away the top qualifier from this morning. The only swimmer with a long course lifetime best under 210, 20908. It's her best. The way she swam this morning, I think we're going to see another lifetime best. She is one of the future stars of the butterfly. She's just 15 years old. We're likely to see her in the finals at the Olympic trials the next year. This is just the, uh, another step in that direction. All right, so we'll be keeping our eyes out on the whole field, but putting a spotlight on Cassidy Bayer throughout this race. Cassidy Bayer is coming out to the first 50, and she will lead as expected, 28-63. She's out fast. Your grief, she's not letting up. She's letting people know that she is in charge here. Cassidy Bear looking controlled, smooth, effortless, as you should in the first 100. Woo, 101.52. She's on pace to go 207. At 15 years old, that is an amazing swim. She can hold on to her pace. She is out really fast. Well, she's not paying for it at the end. Again, the key here is to build and work it to this third 50 to set yourself up to swim fast this last 50. 136.08, she's off a little bit for that 207. Her lifetime best is 209. Looks like she may beat that, but she's got to stay on her pace. Yeah, she might have gone out a little fast. We're going to see how she holds on. Will be Cassidy Bear. 211-32. She really suffered that last hundred, but still a very gallant, gallant swim for Cassidy Bear to win. 213-08. Ruby Martin. And that's under the Olympic trials time. And then we had Lauren Case. 214.97, just two 100s under the Olympic trials qualifying time. Congratulations to her. So Cassidy Bear, I know that was a tough swim, but without much long course preparation, not much can be expected. You can't get best times at every meet. I know she would love to have done it here, but we're going to see her do some great things this summer. I'm